final report of the Artemis Station. 393 days since the anomaly. Our orbit has degraded, and soon this station will impact the surface of the moon. The mysterious phenomenon that has taken over our universe will soon destroy all of us, but we now know that some of our artifacts will reach future Kerbals. As the universe pulled apart around us, hints of the cycles that came before appeared. A thousand thousand generations of Kerbals have lived and died in this space, and the cycles continue. We have outlived our time. On the last trip to the Mun, we found the shattered hulk of a ship powered entirely by RCS fuel. There is no possible way it could have reached the Mun using the physics we know. We can only conclude that the laws of physics themselves are mutable over long periods. In orbit of Kerbin, we recovered a previously unknown piece of debris, clearly artificial. It held the navigation computer for an interplanetary starship, but bafflingly, the navigation computer showed no planets in our system besides Kerbin. What purpose could it have possibly served? The slip near tells us they found two fuel tanks on the surface of Tylo, each with a lander leg attached. Clearly one of our predecessors had arrived there before. Two others may have slammed into Jules Moon around the same time. We don't know for certain what from our cycle will carry into yours, but if you found this, know that the spaceship Slipnir remains in a very high polar orbit over Jewel. Prometheus should be somewhere in system. We haven't heard from them in months. Whoever finds this, I wish you luck. Each cycle seems to be more complex than the last, so your challenges are likely greater than ours. We don't know exactly what we're building towards, but we know that one common element unites us all. The other space center is the key.